In this lesson, we're going to identify the lines of symmetry in a 2D shape, and we're going to reflect an object in its axis of symmetry. We'll begin with question A. The pentagonal star has a line of symmetry at each vertex of the star, as you can see from the red lines of symmetry. So in total, there are five lines of symmetry in the pentagonal star. For question B, the equilateral triangle itself would have three lines of symmetry, but the arrow in the centre reduces that to one line. And for C, a circle would have an infinite line of symmetry, but the rectangle in the centre gives it two lines of symmetry, a vertical and horizontal. And for question D, Again, there is a horizontal and a vertical line of symmetry, which is two lines of symmetry. Now we're going to reflect an object in its axis of symmetry. And we'll do this by reflecting each vertex. So as you can see, as we reflect each vertex and join it to the previous one, every point is the same distance from the vertical mirror line or axis of symmetry. And we carry on like this to the end. For the second question, we're going to perform a vertical and a horizontal reflection. And again, each vertex is the same distance from the axis of symmetry. And now we're going to flip this horizontally, which is a horizontal reflection. And again, every vertex is the same distance from the, the vertical mirror line. And for question D, we're going to reflect the object through a diagonal mirror line so every point passes through at 90 degrees and again the vertices are the same distance from the mirror line and we carry on like this through both mirror lines so you can see a clear pattern throughout Thank you for watching, I hope you found it useful and you can check out the full lesson in the link in the description.